One year ago, the Kids Eat Right program began its campaign to address childhood nutrition in America. And at the heart of Kids Eat Right is a nationwide network of volunteers committed to spreading the message of good nutrition and health for children and their families. In Georgia, Deneen Rogers was concerned that children in her community weren't eating enough fresh vegetables and that they didn't understand where food comes from. She teamed up with food service manager Kathy York to create a vegetable garden for teaching young students about healthy foods. Working in the vegetable and garden here at Dorset Shoals Elementary School has changed me a lot. The most rewarding part of participating with this program was to see the reaction of the children, being able to show students to do their own garden, to be able to taste food that comes from out of the ground. Instead of seeing everything on the supermarket and thinking that the supermarket is where food comes from, it's much more than that. Launched by the American Dietetic Association and the ADA Foundation, Kids Eat Right brings the issues of healthy weight and access to quality foods through member-driven initiatives in communities, schools, public policy, and in the media. In upstate New York, Laura Sugarwalla was concerned about hunger in the inner city. Rochester is very diverse. There's, there are populations from all different sectors. Food insecurity is high in Rochester and uh, we have about 36% child hunger. I've been working for Foodlink, which is the food bank of uh, the western region. We serve 10 counties in our area, and our nutrition education program has three different components. Um, one is our Kids Can program, which was developed at Foodlink. Cooking Activity and Nutrition is what the CAN stands for. And the kids come in and get to uh, have a nutrition education lesson, as well as do hands-on cooking. And that's been the primary focus in our six-week program. So some of the favorite moments I've had are when children don't know the difference between zucchini and a cucumber, and all of a sudden we teach them about the, the cucumber and the zucchini, and then they can see those at the market, and they come back and they say they've tried zucchini and something, and it's, it's very exciting. Kids Eat Right is a collaborative effort, bringing together many programs with a common goal to mobilize members and to educate families, communities, and policymakers about the importance of quality nutrition. In California, Moran Hermesh Zoman had a passion for bringing messages of healthy foods to her community. Using her connections both as a personal chef and as a mother, Moran began working with local schools and hosting culinary demonstrations. As a Kids Eat Right volunteer, I promote healthy eating habits by giving presentations either at my son's school or volunteer with programs like SOS Mentor who provide fun, nutritious lessons to kids of all ages. In Illinois, Anna Schlachter and Carla Hanselman worked to pass a Kids Eat Right resolution in the Illinois Senate. Illinois is like um, all other states in that we are really looking at a serious problem with obesity um, in our state. And so in order to address that at a policy level, we need to help legislators understand what a potential solution is. The Kids Eat Right program offered us an opportunity to say, here's something that we can offer as a tool, and we also will work with legislators and with the school system then to utilize that tool. We had to think about the wording, um, how to approach it, as well as what we're really doing. So on the Kids Eat Right volunteer screen, policy is one of them. So I was sitting there thinking, why not include the whole state? So that's where the idea came from. In Arizona, Adrian Udarby had a passion to improve the nutrition and health of kids across her state. As a public health professional and registered dietitian in Arizona, we find that many of our communities are facing problems with lack of access to healthy foods and physical activity. So we're working with these communities themselves to try to increase access to healthy eating and active living. My favorite Kids Eat Right actions have been the opportunities to work with the school and the campaign messaging in which we go out um, and promote nutrition and physical activity. As Kids Eat Right continues its journey, its heart and soul, the people who teach children, help families, feed communities, and ultimately create a better tomorrow, are its volunteers. I find both personal and professional fulfillment 
as a registered dietitian and as a mom in supporting Kids Eat Right because I know that I'm making a difference not only in the communities and schools in which my children are growing up, but for all children here in Arizona and for all children uh, throughout the United States. There's no way that we can combat childhood obesity unless we are all joining together to try to reverse this epidemic. My name is Adrian Udarby. I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer. I am registered dietitian Anna Schlachter, and I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer. I am Moran Hermesh Zoman in California. I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer. I am Laura Sugarwalla in Rochester, New York. I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer. I am registered dietitian Carla Hanselman, and I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer. I am Deneen Rogers from Douglasville, Georgia, and I am a Kids Eat Right volunteer.